Hello, Nurse Erica here, getting my herbalist on. Hit the like and subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you won't miss any uploads. Let's get at it. Hello, Nurse Erica here, getting my herbalist on with another video. Today's video is about Kion Balm that is available on our website, EssenceToHealing.com. If you feel like this ointment or this balm is a good fit for you, Order some today. I just want to come to you and tell you what is in this balm. Cayenne or capsation is a natural analgesic, which means it relieves pain <clears throat> and with continued use on the body. This ointment can help alleviate a lot of back pain, strains, sprains, back aches, arthritis, bruises, etc. Capsaicin when used on the body, causes a sensation of heat that activates certain nerve cells in your body, which reduces pain. Inside this wonderful oil, it's a beautiful orange oil, in my formula, I put arnica oil. Arnica oil is great for swelling, joint pain, as well as inflammation and muscular aches. I also put calendula oil in here, which reduces pain. It's an anti-inflammatory, and it helps with swelling. Also in this wonderful balm, we have St. John Mort, which is great for soreness, muscle pain, joint pain, bruises. It's an incredible massage oil. So all of that is inside of here. But one thing that really stands out to me is the lavender. Now, there are two different kinds of lavender. There's lavender that you know that helps you to relax. It's great smelling, and we can put it in certain um, products to help us relax in your laundry or anything like that. But the particular lavender that I want to discuss today is spike lavender. I use this in this formula. Spike lavender is a stress reliever. It reduces pains. It's great for headaches, the anti-inflammatory. Great pain management and eases aches and pains. So this spike lavender is inside of our product. So what I'm going to do is put on a glove and put a little bit of this on and show you how we rub it on. The reason why I'm suggesting a glove is because it will create heat. It's not going to burn you like fire. It creates a warming sensation. And it's best that you do not rub your eyes or get any of this balm in your mucous membranes because that is when you will feel the burn. So let me put this glove on and rub a little bit of this on and show you how it's applied. Okay, we are all gloved up. Okay, if you order this from us, I'll send you one of these little spatulas so you won't have to be digging down in there. And I got like a small nail, a little bit of length to my nail. This is the reason why I put this glove on also. I just don't want it to get under my nail beds and start burning because it will do that. It's capsaicin. So you just take it and put a little bit of on, a little bit of it on. I'm not gonna put it on, I'll put I'll rub it in my glove to show you how. It's an, it's a balm, but it melts easily. And it's a great massage oil. And the more you use this the more effective it will be. So if you feel like this is a good fit for you, arthritis pain, sciatic pain, sciatic pain, excuse me, um, joint pain, aches, sprains, strains, if you feel like this may help you, inbox me, DM me, or just order it from my website. We'll ship it out to you. The great pain reliever. I've had a lot of success stories from people that have ordered this from us. So this is Nurse Erica here, getting my herbalist on. I'm going to go and rub this on my knee. Thanks for watching. Okay. I said I was going to put it on my knee, but I actually put it on my wrist. As you can see, I put it here. All I feel is just a warming sensation. I'm not going to say like a Bengay. It's just warm, just like you put a, a warm towel on my on my wrist. It's not burning. So this is the actual application that I put on there. And I just rubbed it in. As you can see, there's 
slightly discoloration of the skin, which will go away after this absorbs. So let us know if this oil is a great fit for you. EssenceToHealing.com Now available. Follow us on Facebook, YouTube, Pinterest, Instagram.